no other over here. We have Jen versus Cody. The Prince of New York versus uh, one of Long Island's and New York's one, finest peaches around. And taking it back to the town and the city. Yep, seeing quite a bit of town and city start some matches here today. And with Cody, right? Cody has a really explosive game with the turnups. And, you know, as Paulo Tana, you kind of do not want Peach to pluck them turnups because they get in, they get one solid confirm, and it's kind of a G. And you already know Cody has those turnup combos unlocked. Because if you make Peach, you don't have those turnups unlocked, what are you doing? Yeah, exactly. Go to the left. It's time for you to work it on out. It's yeah. like, Jen, you know, working on out with the down tilt to the forward air. You see a lot of auto reticle in this matchup to prevent them from pulling the turnip. Yeah, and you know that Jen really wants to shut down Cody's approaches as well, but good neutral get up from the slot dodge. Able to get that back throw on in, and I can see that's uh, this is an offer that Jen really likes to go for early on in the set, and it works out for him quite a bit. Yep, let's we'll see how he gets out of the corner here against Peach. Yeah, he oh. is able to get back in center space and is able to get the nair. Trying to tie it off with the fair as well, but catching Cody, jumping away. A bit dangerous out here on this platform. Yeah, and uh -oh. Cody really likes to go for the sides in that situation as well as a recovery option. And Jen very well knows that. Might even oh see a no, counter what read are you on that. air dodging for? That's one thing about Cody, you know. You start pushing him, and those air dodges kind of start showing in that disadvantage state. You have Jen getting a lot of data on these down throws, these off stage situations. Yeah, a lot of data building. And that's one thing I can say is don't let it be you. Don't let it be you. Hold your resources. You want to make the most out of it. Yeah. Another another side be punished. Yeah, but there's that air dodge as well. I don't know what you're air dodging for. Jen's gotten a lot of mileage out of these side town city platforms. Yeah, but I understand the idea in that situation. No, like, I'm in disadvantage. Palu has really aggressive pressure to kind of just kind of delete my stock with the up air and uh, just an air as well. So I'm going to be air dodging. I want to get out of the situation immediately. And look at this. Jen is shutting down Cody's approaches to allow him to get inside of that space with the auto radical. And that damage is slowly building. Jen, you know, holding out with his three stock. He has that 158, but Cody just needs, like, that one solid there, that one solid back air to kind of just maybe put some put some mileage, you know, put some gas in the tank. Yeah, just get yourself started somewhere and go from there. There it is, the back yeah. air out of shield. But now he needs that one kind of try and true peach turn up. I like the cross up on the shield with the down air. But there we go. Jen DI on out of that combo though. Only escaping with the 25. Definitely not what you want to cash out with. Catching Peach of the down tilt there. Yeah, Paulo locking it down at the ledge though. Catching the neutral get up with the jab and trying to close out with the neutral get or the explosive flame. But I like it when Paulo's kind of just dropped out in there. It's like, I can just do this. This is free damage, you know. It still puts me in a very safe situation. Jen not quite getting that back in the situation and Cody capitalizing on it, getting a little bit of damage off that 62 on the gen this time around. There you go, down to it up, fair it on out. Yeah, Peach with some rage here, can get a fairly early kill. Peach with some rage is scary. Her moves hit all. Yep. And you can see him trying to call it out, but Jen rushing on in with the dash attack. He's shutting down Cody's open dreams for this game one. And we'll see what pick, kind of pieces he'll pick up in this game too. Yep. And all right, I think I'm actually going to head over and join Redemption Bracket for a bit. Might commentating with you. Yep, thanks, man. Of course, it was great. Maybe be back later. We'll see. But good luck for now. Thank you. All right. It's solo Snivy Collins time. You know, already know the deal. Holding down the fort. Who's with me, gang? Who's with me in the chat? Do you want your boy Cody to win the GOAT? Or do you want the Prince of New York to uh, take it down domin dominatingly over Cody? But I see that we are switching to Kalos. All right. I kind of like the stage this summer around for Cody's counter pick, you know? But, oh, oh okay. Some, some shenanigans happening this time around. But Jen starting off very solid, getting the up air train on the board. Trapping Cody's landing, making sure he does not breathe. There's that fair kick him in the corner of the down tilt. And a little too, pulling got a little too early on the back here. You know, you definitely are very aware of Cody's air dodges in the situation this time around. So you're going to have to watch out for those because that's kind of your key to just close it out very confidently. And Jen's still holding it down. There's that up air, putting in the work. Trapping 
the landing with the dash attack as well, the back air, you know, you really want that challenge. You want to get out of the situation, but Jen busted out the, the one-time reflect for the one time, you know, the funny haws. Get in that damage. Cody trying to make the worst, trying to trap. Oh, no. Jen is aware. He reacted to Cody in the situation, opting to go high and avoid that situation entirely. That was phenomenal recognition. Hey, no, you can actually get that angle. That's crazy. Yeah, Cody really wanted to steal this out. You know, you can see him hovering around for the back air and the bear as well. We you know cashing out with a little bit of slaps. You are going to be getting better in this situation in the corner. And there's that forward throw on the get up on the shield. And there you go. Once again, all right. Turn up covering the roll in progress. Chad with a little bit of a 2 command all dash attack on the shield. Figuring that Cody, of course, figuring Cody wants to pull a turn up. He kind of catch him on the dash back. I like the idea, but unfortunately committing a little too much on the situation. Am I on? I am on. Blessed. What's going are. on? What's going on? We got Jen versus Cody. I haven't. I don't think I've seen this matchup before. We already know what's up. Yes, indeed. This is Cody, a local Westchester farmer. Yes, sir. From the Long Island, right now. Yes, you know, Jen kind of, kind of farming Cody at the moment, but you know, Cody clutches up just a little bit. You know, is able to capitalize a lot more on the situations this time around. She definitely is. I mean, Cody. One thing about Cody is like, there's two things that are very scary about Cody, right? It's his ledge trapping and it's his and it's his punish game. And th both of those are very, very rehearsed right now. So if he gets Jen on the ledge, I'm actually very scared to see what kind of like, damage and like mind yeah, he's gonna pull that, out to keep him there. In that game one, it was kind of a near three stock for Jen, but in this oh, time geez. around, you can oh, oh, oh god. No, not this combo. Oh, I've seen god. that one way too many times. This setup right here, the scoops ahoy! Yeah. And then, oh my god. Almost like frame trapped the mess out of him. Another frame trap, Jen. Yeah, what Cody a Cody's given Jen too many of these air dodges and that near one up tilt. Not able to take it, but you're already putting Cody in the corner this time around. This is where Paul yeah. kind of excels with that ledge trapping. But, you know, going on out, he's going to be making it out. Yeah, just trying to look for more defensive options for Cody from Cody right here. And Gen C scouting up, trying to scout out the jump board. Just another air dodge. Ooh. Speaking of scouting out the air dodge, well, look at that back air. Colleen as a whistle, bro. Yeah, definitely not out of the woods in any time. And just trying to punish on the tech on the platform with the turn up. Not able to do it, though. And Jen, you know, looking to get on in. He's seeing Cody kind of hovering around. Not option to go for any turn-up pulls. And you can see these air dodges. I let, you know, I get the idea from Cody, right? I'm in Oh, no, you're going for oh, oh, the What a reversal. All right. What a reversal. And Cody's got a saddle. Table? And Whoa. he got a shield break. Let's see what big combo Cody got pulling up right here. Good job. Uh, combos. Good uh, job. Oh, no, combo. he didn't get the side beat. Oh, that's so important. I believe Jen kind of DI'd down, so he wouldn't be in that situation. Yeah, smart DI from Jen, I will say. But now he's has he's got some keep up to play. Granted, I'm pretty sure Jen is just like you know, ah, uh, it's fine. I just gotta get my opening, and he's kind of been doing that the whole set, from what I've noticed. But uh, uh Cody with a lead. That's Cody with confidence, and I, I've seen a confident Cody. Confident Cody's kind of scary, but these spot dodges, not too scary at all. Jen ain't scared of nothing right now. Yeah, these air dodges are definitely not and doing not doing any favors Jesus. and. Rolling right. into the arms of the Paul Tata, Jen hanging around to get this back air, and, and there you go, he's gonna find Jesus it from the down Christ. tilt. That down tilt, that, that, that's, that is baby's first ledge trapping it right is. there, man. Paul is that free, free ledge trapping. It is Stay literally man. free real estate. <laughs> Actually, just throw out the down tilt, wait for, not even, you don't even need to wait for the option, just throw out the